can't speak for other businesses because I don't know how they operate. Twinies operate in a um, in a way now that I think is uh, I, I've got quite a passion for open innovation, so I like people to talk about what they're doing. So um, the system we've put in place at Twinings suits that model, and we like to get everybody involved, and um, and that's just the way we work. Um, other businesses, I would imagine, there's probably some quite close-minded people. People who don't like to share ideas, and. Um, I think they're missing out on an opportunity, I really do. It's just so important to get the right people around the, around the table and the way these events are run is perfect for that. You Any area which you think digital printing needs to move on to or improve on now? I think that the one thing that we still have to work on is the education. I think that as far as digital printing is concerned and the digital printer is concerned, we have a responsibility to the brands, we have a responsibility to the end user and we have a responsibility to our own marketplace to actually keep talking about what we do and keep educating people. And that's been the be one of the benefits of today. I think events like this today are, are really important, so not only is it getting um, like-minded individuals together and companies together, um, but it's also about then sharing, um, and there's some things that this morning that, you know, I've written down quite a few notes as well, um, so things that I've learned today, so it's about being able to learn from others, learn from others' experiences, um, and then, you know, think about how then we can share and develop those on, so it's really important. Today. I've really enjoyed um, communicating with other people who are using digital print, um, taking the ideas from some of the bigger brands like Coca-Cola and ABF and actually being able to sort of think about ways of transposing those ideas into a, a smaller brand like Neil's Yard and being able to um, explain to them the challenges that I have within the Neil's Yard business. So it's been a really worthwhile day and I've really enjoyed every minute of it. We, uh, we need to listen to each other. Um, people today who've been here have showed me quite a few ideas that I hadn't actually thought of. So that's from a retail perspective. So it's been very good to talk to them, listen and, and, and if you like, get some new ideas that we haven't thought of. And there's two I've already got today, which I've already gone to one of the printers and said, Hey, what about this? We are all in the same arena where most of the people that are here today are all doing the right things. They're, they're, they're here. There um, doesn't need to be the secrecy behind, be, be behind the digital production that we do. And we share information with, with, with other competitors. We're quite open about what we're doing. We all do things in, in a unique way, which puts us at the front of what we're doing. Um, but to share information is, is a good thing. I think it's essential because, you know, for years digital print has come with almost a shadow over it. You know, we've heard them talk today that print quality is no good, there's this limitation, that limitation. By getting in front of them and talking to them directly to them, part of what we are trying to do is take away all of that doubt and almost take away all of... As, as Chris said earlier on, the rule book, throw that in the bin and start again and really put a new face to digital print. It's nice to see so many retailers and brand owners um, in such good dialogue with, uh, with the industry and with the converters that uh, are trying to bring these pr products and uh, innovations to uh, fruition. So it's very important that these events work. If they work, we'll be here again. If they don't, we won't. I'm pleased to say it's gone really well today, so that helps a lot. And it's been good use of my time.